Today I will be informing you as to how to enable core GUI for your plugins such as event blocks. First, in Studio, go to File, Studio Settings, Studio, and then scroll all the way down until you see Show Core GUI in Explorer while playing. Hit the check mark, hit close, and then hit restart. You will not see this. Now, on the top right, you will see Core GUI once your Roblox Studio has finally restarted. Hit the arrow. And then you will see each plugin in Core GUI that has GUI. Go to, for this example, Event Blocks. And then you will see GUI and Block Editor Selector. This is somewhat useless. In Block Editor Selector, you will see another useless thing. Go to GUI. And then for this example, coding area. The coding area is going to be this area. If you were to go into here, oh actually no, if you were to go into help and make a server script, this here is the coding area. Keep your eye on the coding area. If I'm going to place this here when this script starts, when start shows. If I place touched, it will do touch begin. If I were to delete touch, touch begin is deleted. If I were to delete when this script starts, that gets deleted too. That is the coding area. And then, for this other example, Add Category Panel Categories. These will show each category. So if I were to go back to Help, Script, and Open, Add Category, you will see the categories listed here. Leader Stats, Marketplace, Raycasting, and Tweening. Each showing in here too. If I were to close Categories, and close help. I will now enter the block palette, which shows the blocks, types, search bar, view mode, and remove overlay. For this example, I will go to blocks. And each one here are the blocks. Or at least the categories for those blocks. If I were to go to operators and number. In input, I will be able to see, I will be able to change the input. If you go to operators and the number, you'll see that there's some blue, which is might be a bit higher on YouTube side. It will say 9 here. But what if I wanted to change the default value of that number to be 100. Well, in here I can. If you go down into text, you are able to change it to anything you'd like, such as 100. That is one of the many features in Core GUI. For event blocks, or heck, any other GUI plugin out there that obviously has it in Core GUI. That is a 4 minute and 50 second tutorial on how to enable Core GUI.